Hello, welcome back to Uncle Al's Barbecue. Here are my beef ribs. Let's unwrap these. In case you didn't watch my other video, I said I was going to cook these like a brisket. And I smoked them on the smoker. I tried to keep it at 250 because I have some baby backs over here. I did it at the same time. I seasoned it lightly like a brisket and we wrapped her in butcher paper and full just like we would do a brisket. Woohoo! Look at that, man. All right, I did not tallow these. They are just sitting the way. Ooh, that's some good au jus. I'm gonna have to save this. Let me move that to the side. All right, let's adjust this camera. Make sure you guys can see these good looking ribs. All right, and there you have it. Look at the juice on them. I may have messed up the video. I don't know. I'm home by myself, but no tallow. Just wrapped them like I would a brisket. Look at them bones. I mean, man, let's, let's get us a little slice here. Let's see what we look like. Let's see what we look like. Huh? Hmm? Are we looking at that? Are we looking at that? I mean, man, there's a smoke ring, just just like the brisket. Let's give it a taste. Mmm, man. That beef rib is fantastic. Here's them baby backs. Slide that over. These two were smoked with the beef rib. Let's cut you through. Where are you? It's so barked out I can't find the bone. <laughs> Woo! That's what happened with these ribs. Woo! There we go with that. Trying to cut it across. These ribs are still hot. A little juice coming out of there. You've seen my other rib video. All I did was spray these. I did not Three, two, one of them. I just smoked them and put them in the oven. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Man, oh man. I hope y'all can see this. Well, I will tell you this. As tender and delicious as this beef rib is, and it is, but it's more, if you know how to cook a ribeye, and got a ribeye cooked real, really, really well. That's what it's basically kind of like a steak. You know, like they're saying this comes off the back of the ribeye. They cut it near the bone. So it's kind of like a steak rib. Mm. If you want to get to it, it might taste a little bit like a flat on a uh, brisket. Mmm. Those baby backs, man. That thing is just so tender. So, the rib challenge. Which would you prefer? Who wins? The beef ribs or them baby backs? Man, that's a tough decision. I would say if you're in the mood for steak, go beef rib. It's steaky. If you want some tender, and you can ladle the sauce on these things, make them sweet, hot, spicy. You know, that I'd say there's more variation with the baby back as far as what you would want, what you would want as flavor. Grocery that beef for, mmm, man. Huh. I tell you what, them beef ribs need a, a potato next to them. Those things turned out outstanding. I hope you watched my other video. I hope you're having a happy 4th of July weekend. Thank you to all the veterans out there. Police and fire, first responder, Mr. Ambulance, Mrs. Ambulance. Thank you, everybody. Please leave a comment. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It won't hurt you. Woo, man. I got to tell you, I don't know. I'm leaning towards the steak. <laughs> I got to get another bite, man. Mmm, man.
I think it's because I haven't made these in such a long time. Man, I'm telling you. It's, it's, it's close. It's close to a brisket with a bone in it. It's pretty close. Pretty close on, on the, uh, on the flat. On the flat, not the, not the point. There's nothing better than, than the point. Okay. Thank you again. That's how I did it. Mmm, I hope I made you hungry. Hope it made you mad at me. Come on, get out there and cook, man. Get out there and cook. Fire up that smoker. You can do it. All right, thank you for barbecuing with me today.